Amen, wonderful saints. we got a good, powerful word. So let me break this word down. And our word will be coming out of 1 Timothy 4, and we're at 14 through 16. Let us understand what thus says the Lord through the Apostle Paul, through the epistle to Timothy. Neglect not the gift that is in thee, the Apostle tells Timothy, which was given thee by prophecy with the laying of the hands of the church, of the Presbyterian. So through prophecy, you know, was the gift given to him and to us by the laying of the hands of the Presbyterian through the body of Christ, through the church and the land of him. Meditate upon these things, the apostle tells them, give thyself wholly unto them. So as we meditate on the doctrine of Christ, as we meditate on the gifts that the Lord bestowed in our life, give ourselves wholly unto it. You know, give our all into it upon these things. Give thyself wholly unto them that thy profit may appear to all. So as you give yourself wholly to a thing, the prophet can appear unto all because it's going to be reflecting in your life. It's going to be exuberating and fan in your life to where people can see what's exemplifying in your character and in your life. Take heed unto thyself, unto the doctrine. Continue in them, for in doing this thou shalt both save thyself and them that hear thee. So getting holy with the scripture, continuing on in the doctrine, have the ability not only to save you, but to save others. A lot of people are running around right now and they do not know the doctrine of Christ Jesus. It's important for us not to sit under the tutelage of people so long that we forget what God wants to do with us and that God is doing in our life. Do not neglect the gift that the land of the hands by the church and what God has transferred and doing and wants to do in your life. This is important, saying So as you get... You know, familiar with these scriptures and the doctrine and understanding Christ Jesus, let them reflect so people may see your good work and glorify your Father in heaven. Hallelujah. So I thank you today. You guys have a blessed, good, wonderful day. In Jesus' mighty, powerful name. Hallelujah.